On the computer desktop, double-click the simple ABI icon. When the program opens, select File, New, New ABIQ Report. The report will open, and you can enter patient information, risk factors, symptoms, ICD codes, etc. With the patient in the supine position, wrap 10 cm cuffs at each site. At the ankle, start by wrapping the bladder portion first. Place the cuff under the ankle and wrap it around the ankle, holding it in place with one hand while wrapping it with the other. Try to wrap it straight. You can rotate it around to get the hose out of the way of the artery. When wrapping the cuffs on the legs, the patient may try to hold their leg up to help, but ask them not to because when they relax their leg, the cuff may loosen. Attach the hoses from the cufflink control unit to cuffs. The yellow connectors go to the ankles. White hoses go to the patient's right side, blue to the left. To obtain a PVR waveform, click on one of the boxes for taking a waveform in the middle of the screen. Press the button with the waveform image on it on the top right of the remote. The cuff will inflate to about 80 millimeters of mercury and then slowly deflate to about 65 millimeters and stop while the waveform is obtained. Note, PVRs require patient cooperation. Limb motion affects the waveform. Patients should be instructed not to move or talk during this test. The waveform will start to appear after the cuff reaches 65 millimeters. If you are not satisfied with the waveform, you may push the waveform button again to overwrite the previous waveform. Press either Next or Back after the waveform is obtained to move to the other side. Repeat the waveform sequence for the other leg. Under each waveform will be the calculated ABIQ. ABIQ Guidelines ABIQ greater than 1.00 indicates normal. ABIQ between 0.90 and 0.99 indicates borderline risk of PAD. ABIQ less than 0.9 indicates increased risk of PAD. When finished, save the report if desired, as described in your user manual.